a meeting of working men at the Haymarket on Randolph Street. What started as a peaceful gathering turned violent. A strike has broken out in Chicago. A serious protest and potential loss of life at the Haymarket. The eight-hour workday has just made history. The Pullman strike. Workers at the Pullman Car Company strike. 2,000 openly defy federal authority, making this the greatest strike in history. Strike at Republic Steel. Between two and 3,000 leave work. 100,000 workers have walked out of their mills demanding better pay. Violence breaks out at strike. Hundreds of workers attacked. 300 injured and 18 Day. Jubilant workers return to the mill tonight under terms of a truce pact. This is a great day for labor. It's a great day for labor. Auto organized. Steel organized. Textile organized. Meat packers organized. Collective bargaining. Health care. Pension. Retirement savings. Fair wages. Furniture workers. Glass workers. Letter workers. Teachers and woodworkers. Five million. Eight million. Ten million. Fifteen million Americans organized. This is where it started. Our backyard. The movement. The change. In Chicago, we have more local ones than anywhere else. This city is our work, and we take pride in it. Because a local, it's more than a number. It's a family. It's why we stand up, why we fight greed, and why we fight injustice. They keep coming to take the rights we earned, the rights we fought for. We can't stop now. We won't stop. Hotel workers, local one. SEIU, Chicago Park District. Chicago Newspaper Guild. Letter carriers. Local 73. 34071. Neighbors, local 1092. IDW, local 9. Iron workers, local 63. When one local stands next to another, it becomes a force, a movement for fairness, for opportunity, for progress. When we stand together, our local becomes a nation.